My name is Jim Estes, and today I'm going to talk about a drill that I think is extremely important for the swing plane. So what I want you to do is, and this, by the way, is going to give you an instant understanding of exactly the feeling you want to have in the golf swing. Take a club. You can put a rod, alignment rod, in the grip, or I'm sorry, in the butt end of the golf club. Take the golf club, turn it like you're going to hold it, and then what I want you to do is take that club, put it right against your left hip, so you're holding both clubs here. Now you've got an alignment rod on the ground and a golf ball. And what I want you to do, getting into your good posture position, your weight over the arches, getting feel balanced. The insides of the heels are going to be about the width of your hips. Take a swing back, slow motion, and trace with that alignment rod the target line all the way up. The shaft should be parallel to your target line at the top. And then slowly coming down, trace the line. And do this in slow motion. Right into the impact position. So this is a great feedback tool, visual feedback tool, for learning the proper swing plane. Go right to your impact position. I encourage you to do this drill in slow motion. And if you have five minutes a day, if you do this drill every day, I guarantee you're going to improve your golf swing. So again, I think you'll find this to be extremely helpful. JimEstesGolf.com if you have any questions. Videos to watch. Lock your elbows. Now this was the last swing you just made. At impact, you bent this elbow, see? Mm -hmm. And you didn't get any weight shift. Right. Now, so at impact, we change your setup to feel like your arms are fully extended. You lock that left elbow, pinch your upper arms together. There you go. And then try to create that feeling at impact. Right. So all your miss hits are a function of moving off the ball, the left shoulder goes up, and then you bend that left elbow right at contact. So, there's only two things you can take away from this lesson. Left shoulder down. Now, we did talk about your pre-shot. Getting your left shoulder pointed at the target. Playing the ball back a little more with your 7-iron through pitching wedge. Make that left shoulder go down. And then full extension and impact. Driving your whole body.